Hello traders out there in Traderland, Des here with Grok Trade. It's Monday, June 6, 2011. And the markets continue to slide. Unlike I, what I told you in the pre-market video, I did get back in time to do the afternoon video as you can see here and thank you for all those emails that have come in uh, for those um, who are uh, showing your support all as well I had a niece had a bad bicycle accident and she's in the hospital now in good hands she is well and doing uh, much better so anyway thank you for that but I'm back and let's look at this the markets continue to sell off Dow down a half a percent one percent on the S&P Nasdaq down over 1.1 percent and almost nearly um, down uh, the Russell's down 1.6 percent we have the banks down 0.8 percent VIX going up almost three percent Gold up, silver up, U.S. dollar up 0.28%. Crude oil down now. We see that oil is below $100 a barrel, just ahead of the OPEC meeting. And looks like airline stocks are down. And it also shows that history shows a bearish future um, for bank stocks. Interesting to see here and see. Take a look at the technicals. Here's the S and P daily crash. I mean, we were. I've been warning about this up here in this rising wedge when it broke down, and now it's coming to fruition. And you cannot ignore these patterns. And sometimes um, I'm guilty of of sharing what I'm seeing too early, uh, because sometimes it takes a little while for them to come to fruition and to develop and to play themselves out. So. Um, yeah, and sometimes for the bulls, it's hard to swallow when you see we just keep going up, 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 and then all of a sudden you get some, te you know, chartists or uh, technical analysts such as myself come out and say, uh oh, you know, it's thunder in the distance, bad things could be happening. And well, anyway, this is what's happening. We just we're making uh, five to six week lows right now. This has been a uh, a real, real turbulent time here in the markets. We continue to slide. And we're busting down below a lot of support areas. Remember, I was looking at the 1305 and then the 1300. We're below 1300, gang. No good at all. I'm going to look here at the spider, see what the volume did today. Uh, just about break even. But I really like to look at the future volume. We have bigger volume here on the sell-off, busting below 13. Really, really uh, bad to see that on, on the NASDAQ daily. Uh, we are right here at the 2700 mark, big area. 2750 was a big one that we busted down below, huge area. On the Russells, um, we're down below the 800 mark. Wow, that is a key area, and that's something not to ignore. Bad, bad area to be busted down. Now, we've been down several days one, two, three, four, four days. Five to six is usually about the average. Uh, before you get some sort of reversal, we've dropped really hard. Things to drop fast and to bounce fast. So you have to be ready. You can't be a full, uh, you can't be loading up on the bear side yet here. We need it for this market to rally back and then perhaps be looking for that. But right now I'm hedged in this market. I don't want any piece of this trying to be one way or the other. Yes, last few days I wish I was a full scale bear. It's just too early for that because we have to be watching the bigger time frames, the monthly and the weeklies and such. So anyway. That's what we're dealing with. But do you see how this is the bearish engulfing? This is an inverted hammer. You have a um, a little kind of like an evening star up here. And uh, so you have a lot of these reversal patterns. Guess what? I'm going to be teaching you these candlestick reversal patterns tonight. All you have to do is click on calendar, click on the link. And for tonight, June 6, and get registered. If you can't make it, that's okay. Get registered and we'll send out the uh, recording. And uh, furthermore, you received an email from me today that I sent out this morning. Um, don't ignore the first one I sent it to you. Do the second one that says oops in the subject line and click on that link and that'll get you to the right place. All right, take care. I hope to see you tonight.